Adventure time. You just had to get that on. <laughs> <laughs> well, speaking of Adventure Time, so that was such an interesting story about Vegas. I feel like we have grown as a friendship. I feel like we have learned some intimate details about each other. And I feel like my opinion of you has changed completely into the exact same thing. So, <laughs> <laughs> my turn, since I guess we're giving a little story time for um, our That So Random edition, and our little free campfire stories. We're going to hashtag write that out or some shit. <laughs> Because, you know, I bring the fire, I bring the flame, I bring the shit, the bitches want to blame, all the drip form, because I got it popping, always in the air, but it's never not dropping. Okay, but, um, right, so, speaking of rappers... <laughs> Speaking of rappers, rapper Young Thug had a birthday party this week. He turned 30, which I was highly surprised about. I was like, I had no idea that me and Young Thug were anywhere like within like six to seven years of an age range. You weren't in high school with me. Uh, you no. were older than my oldest brother, so we weren't I'm 43 in high to be exact. Mm. <laughs> right. I was like, damn, you mean to tell me that me and Young Thug could have been in, like, elementary school together? Okay, I got a question. But, uh, <laughs> so, had a party, uh, got the invite. Um, it was interesting. We're about to get into it, because it was a lot. <clears throat> so, turns out that the party, um, we weren't able to get the actual address to the party. It's like the way they had it set up was you had to take a shuttle to the location. And the shuttle was somewhere far as fuck. Like, if you're familiar with Atlanta, it was in Clayton County. Mind you, I'm in Gwinnett County. So, mm. we'll, I don't know. A map might be brought up, but it was far. So, okay. Get to um, our friend's spot because that's a little closer. Uh, she stayed, like, by the airport. Uh, so, they're drinking, you know, turning up, doing a little pre-party shit or whatever. Uh, it's time to call the Uber. Go to call the Uber. I'm thinking that the Uber is going to be like, you know, five, six minutes or whatever. We're by the airport. Mm -hmm. you know, the airport's pretty like close to downtown Atlanta. Like, it's a lot of shit going on by the airport. Guess how long it took that Uber to come? A long periodically time. I call that Uber. That Uber is 24 minutes away. Uh, by the airport? 24 minutes away. I was like, damn, what's going on with Uber? Like, I haven't Ubered anywhere in a while, but shit, is that the new wave? Let us know, cousins. Is Uber expensive as fuck in, okay. like, a lot where y'all are? Wherever and to... you are. <laughs> it's high here too, so, though. yeah, so I uh, called the Uber. It was also, as I said, expensive as fuck, so it was a lot going on with that, because, mind you, we didn't have to go that far. It was maybe, like, you know, 15, 20 minutes. So... Uber comes, um, get inside or on the way to the party. We end up going through this subdivision. And you know those subdivisions that take like literally 10 minutes to get through the subdivision? So we are, it's one of those where it's like we're going through, we're winding on, it's dark. We end up, and we're, I look and I see that we're supposed to be at a church. It's, that's where the shuttles are picking people up at. So I'm kind of like, I mean, okay, it's kind of weird that we're going through this neighborhood, but maybe like it opens up into a major street or some shit. So it doesn't. We end up getting to the back of the neighborhood and it's like a clubhouse and there's a small street and it looks like to where if you were able to go, it would be where the back of the church that we need to get to is, but it's locked. And there's like some, there's like a gate there that's locked. So you can't go. So the, and mind you the Uber, right at that moment, we realized that like, there's nothing there. We're at the wrong place. Uber's like, Bing! like it got to where it was supposed to be. So the guy's looking at us like, well, get the fuck out. <laughs> it was like, uh, no, like, can you take us to the actual spot? Because mind you, I forgot to mention, it has been pouring down rain all day. Pouring down rain, like fucking, I don't know, tropical depression number 69. Bitch, it was wet. So <laughs> we're able to get him, yeah. So we're able to get him to go around and go back through the neighborhood, which mind you, is like another 10 minutes on top of everything. 
and go back out and go out to the main street and we get to where the church is. So at this point, it's been like 30 minutes past when we were supposed to get there. And if you don't know with these types of events, if you're not like VIP or know the motherfuckers individually or media or some shit close to them, then you need to get there early because you will be in line if you're not. So on top of all of this, on top of me and my group of friends going, uh, I tell my mom's friend about it as well, too. So she's like, oh, I'm coming, too. So my, as we're on the way there, she's like, oh, I'm already here. I'm seeing the shuttles go past. Hell, I was like, we good. I'm just waiting on y'all. So- <laughs> no, that's right. I'm already at the I'm, here, I'm waiting on y'all. I could get on the shuttle, but I'm going to wait for y'all. Yeah. So we get there 30 minutes later. We link up with them or whatever. So like it's about seven of us in the group now. It's pouring down rain. Umbrellas are being passed around. Weaves is getting sweated out. Everybody's wearing like all shades of animal print looking like these pillows behind me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Like it, it, it was a lot. My curls is just... Like, I'm looking like fucking, I don't know, Macy Gray with a blowout. Like, <laughs> but you know what? We gonna make it rock. We gonna make it rock. So, get to this um one nigga, and he's like one of the people, you know, doing security, trying to get the carts going. Um, He's like, if y'all pay me $5, I'll be able to get y'all into the party, or be able to get y'all into the shuttle so y'all can go with the next round. Because at this point, it's like 200 people, like, waiting on the shuttles, and what we thought were shuttles, we're finding out, are like the white church vans that people would <laughs> fucking take to church functions, and then the small sprinters that they would take on Real Housewives. So at most, these bitches is fitting, like, maybe be 15 people when we're thinking that they're shuttles that are going to be fitting like 50 people a piece. It was like, no, they're church vans. Not thinking y'all church <laughs> vans. Oh my god. So we were like, what the fuck? It's like pouring down rain, 200 black people, all wearing whatever the fuck. Just, yeah. So, my mom's friend, she's she's good. She's good. She's like, I got my red bottoms. My feet kind of hurt, but you know, she kinda, you can tell she kind of getting over it. My friends, we over it. We're trying to make deals. We paid our $5. The, the niggas started scamming and oh, was like, it was a lot. So, my one friend was like, no, you need to let us the fuck on this shit right now. So, it really got to me. was like, oh, is there about to be some action going on? <laughs> So, we eventually are able to get onto a shuttle. Uh, we end up being on there with, I don't know if uh, cousins are familiar with uh, Jerrica, Young Thug's girlfriend, wife. Uh, her entourage was able to get us onto the shuttle with them. Yeah, so able to make it to the party, uh, get to the party. The party itself, eight minutes later. <laughs> the party itself is fun you know we take pictures celebrities are there whatever you know i don't really get starstruck by anybody unless it's beyonce so we're seeing big sean i think we saw gunna we saw 21 savage we saw young thug of course um saw a few people you know make sure you check stories to see those but um yeah uh it was fun it was lit i got drunk as fuck <laughs> So, we had to figure out how to get back. Mm -hmm. It's still pouring down rain at this point. Um, We end up walking to the front of, like, the like the estate because it's a big ass mansion that we're at <laughs> so we have to walk to the front of the estate which takes like five minutes to walk up the driveway it's pouring down rain at this point like my hair is completely saturated with like just soaked with just water i am standing under a tree right now a tree that i had to pee under my hair is saturated my curls are gone and just my clothes are soaked. I was wearing a mesh tank top, soaked. It was just, it, it was so much. Did I mention that now I'm standing outside and pouring rain, waiting on the shuttle to come? Like, I'm standing in fucking, yeah, bitch. It, so end up getting to the front, trying to get on the sprinters to get back. We're like, nah, let's just take an Uber. Look for an Uber. Bitch, Ubers are $98. What? And, and at this point, let me let y'all know, for those who brought up Lyft or whatever, I looked up Lyft the first time. Lyfts were even more than Ubers. Mm. I looked up a Lyft this time. Lyft was $127. Uber was $98. To go like 20 minutes. Mm. I am standing under a tree right now. A tree that I had to pee under. My hair is saturated. 
My curls are gone. So I was like, fuck that, nah. So we end up, all like seven of us, having to pile in my mom's friend's BMW truck thing and like go to where we were all at so that she could drop off my home girl and then go home and we could all get in our cars and go back too. And at that point, I had to drive an hour back from the airport basically to Gwinnett County half drunk even though at this point i was kind of over it so i was definitely sobered up and in the middle of what at this point is now a literal monsoon that is like throwing and hurling rain at me Whew. so that was that was <laughs> wow that was a lot that was that, yeah that sounds like a function in atlanta child the atl function it's like Think you about to get off and be cute and be out there? Here come the monster. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Here come a flat tire. Here come a ninety-eight dollar Uber. This bitch Ubers and Lyfts. Y'all really let us know in the comments too. Ubers and Lyfts was expensive in Las Vegas too. It was like I get it, but you could tell there's like some type of increased price range. Mm -hmm. But anyways, um, the event was pretty unorganized as far as the way to get there and the way to get back but once we got there it you know it was cool it wasn't a long line thank the lord i don't know why it would be a line there because everybody else was at the shuttles mm -hmm. <laughs> so thankfully it wasn't a line at the actual place so we were able to get in pretty quickly and once we got in you know it was nice uh they had these shots that the shot glasses were made out of ice um had a bunch of scrippers Mm -hmm. Uh, had some little finger foods. I was drunk as shit and had to stop at Waffle House. I've been to Waffle House for like a year and a half. <laughs> oh it was so good. I was so lit. It was like six in the morning. I was like, ooh, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> but, yep, that was that. And, bajunks. <laughs> 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 I was just looking like, how you gonna end it? <laughs> Is there a transition coming? <laughs>